Hi dear viewers, this is Arash Kamali with another session of the website programming course under Python programming language and the Django framework. Again, as always, a very warm welcome from me. If you remember, in the previous session, we made a published section for the news so that the admin will be able to publish the news which is not in the publish mode. All right. Uh, the other section that we want to work on is for everyone to see only their own news. To do so, at first, when we want to add the news in a field, we save the name of the person who is adding the news. As you see, we have already saved a blank space uh, for the writer of the news. Okay, now. There are two modes. The user can have a username and his real name. We can save both. The username cannot be changed. Okay, uh, the filtering and the name of the post can be set based on that username. But here, showing the news and the titles, the writer can be shown next to the news. Right here, we can use the real name of the writer. It all depends on how you want to set up uh, the appearance of your site and the changes that you want to apply and how much you are strict about these points. The more strict you are, the better the quality of your site. All right, at first, we need to save the news ad section in a field uh, so we need a field i need to go to the news model okay uh, we already uh, made a writer field we just need to give the right values to this field okay and now in the normal mode our writer is a dash we remove it we write in instead uh, request.user as i said using the request.user command you can receive a current user that has logged in all right uh, now here using the second admin or the normal admin that we just made the second ad made i define a news uh, the name of the news one in each category no special text here a few words we choose an image for it all right and submit just like that as you see the news has been submitted it is in the pending mode and the name is demo the name of the writer is demo all right here I set up the news list filter here news list instead of the dot all I say filter where writer the writer field equals request dot user okay now if i refresh the page i can only see one news and that is the news that i have confirmed here i am in the demo admin the demo that we registered and what happened here here i only saw my own news now we go to the main admin there we refresh the news list and there is no rep because the former news were dash and i cannot see the news of the rest of the admins so here i just need to add a ring a test and as we check with a full ring check and see uh, if the user has access to master panel he will see all the news if he didn't have access to master panel then he is going to see only his own news now here in the news manager I copy the master user permission and here I want to use I say check the permission if it 
didn't have the permission then what then uh, if it didn't have the permission then and if it did yeah if it had the main admin permission then there is no filter okay dot all now if we check now i am in the demo admin and still i see my own news we go to the main admin refresh the main admin and we say all the news so here we separated the news so that the main admin sees all the news but a normal admin only sees his own news just like the ad website that we talked about only his own ads will be shown but we need to remember that the user may make the link manually and he may know the link the url based on the link that we have made for deleting and then he will delete so we need to do something else in our edit and delete buttons functions first we need to check if the writers field equals request.user or not if it is equal then delete and if equal do the deleting otherwise uh, don't do it and we can remove the publish here an ordinary admin should not be able to publish so here in the news list uh, what was the name of the permission we have its name over here master user all right here uh, again we use if we say if perms.main.master user if it has the permission he will see this and and if okay now let's check the main admin the main admin has the publish button and the normal admins cannot see the publish button as we said for more security uh, we need to check both in the view and template for the admin to be able to see the button uh, and if he had the permission he can do a certain activity and if he didn't he should not be able to do that so we need to pay attention to this to check in the view for delete and edit so that if someone wants to do these actions uh, through the URLs that he has memorized first he needs to be confirmed as the writer of the news that he is supposed to be edited or deleted and if the writer equals request.user he will be allowed to do so and if not he will be rejected okay uh, so you can apply this on your site something that we are going to do in the follow-up we are going to add these sections for editing and deleting but you need to use this as we said on all the sections of your site you may have several apps that are used by several admins so you need to apply these details on all of these